What's up guys, my name is Bryce and welcome to Bryce Games. Today we're going to be playing the greatest love game of our generation. It's just... Nah, I'm kidding. We're going to be playing Jurassic Heart. <laughs> Alright, so Jurassic Heart is a dating simulator between a dinosaur and a human. So it's probably going to be the most romantic thing you've ever seen. So let's just hop right into the game. Alright, English is my language and my name, my name is Bryce. There we go, there we go. Alright, it's time to go buy a ukulele with Tadakun. Maybe I should buy him a meal, too. I'm the reason why his old one is broken, after all. Oh, what did I do? Come to think of it, Triple Dot. Isn't this going to be the first time I met him outside of school? Ooh, we're going on a date! This is gonna be great. Now that makes me nervous. Better make sure I don't look funny. Yeah, that, that's always a good thing to do. Let's see, which hair clip should I go for? The usual fossil-shaped hair clip, treble clap. Well, we gotta go with the treble clap. We're going to a music store, after all. I mean, come on now. Hmm, we're going to a music- <laughs> See? See, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Might as well dress for the occasion. Alright. All set. Now I better hurry and go meet him at the station. Wait, wait, am I the girl? Oh, I'm the girl. Okay. <laughs> well, Bryce is a weird name for a girl, but okay. Oh, there he is. Hello, Tyra-kun. Did I make you wait? <laughs> you are so fancy. I like- I like his little tie. It's so nice. Not at all, Bryce. I just got here as well. That's the dinosaur voice. By the way, that hair clip, Triple Dot. Oh, this? Well, since we're going to buy a ukulele, music-related stuff, y you know? I is it weird? No, no, not at all. I think it really suits you. <laughs> really? Thank you. It looks like he likes it. <laughs> I like how they're like whispering in the middle of the conversation. That's good. So, ready to go get your new ukulele? Yes, let's go! Alright! Whatever you say, Batman. Oh, okay, we're here! Alright! Oh, wait, no, I'm the girl, sorry. Alright, let's get you a nice ukulele. Wow, you're really fired up about this, aren't you? tata -kun, I'm the one who put you in that situation at the music club. Of course I feel bad. So choose whatever you like. It's on me. Yeah, about that triple dot. I know how you feel. But I want you to know, it wasn't your fault. You didn't know I would panic in front of people, and d I did, and dropped my old ukulele, breaking that into pieces as a result. Aw, he broke his ukulele, which wouldn't have happened if I didn't force you to play in front of them. Aw, man. But you didn't. I chose to do it myself. If you were forcing me, I wouldn't be here. Oh. Uh, really? Oh, really? I'd feel terrible if you had to pay for something I did. So just let me pay for it, okay? Hmm... It's hard for me to tell from his face, but he sounds really upset. He does. Oh no, what, sh what should I do, guys? I don't know what to do! Insist on paying, ask him to pay half the price, or give it up and let him pay. Well, I think... I don't want to let him pay by himself, and I'm not gonna insist to pay because that'd be mean. So, I'm just gonna say, pay half the price? That way it's fair for both of us? You're right. I should have thought about how you feel. I'm sorry, Tyra-kun. It's alright. I'm glad you understand. Still, I really feel like part of this is my fault. So how about we meet halfway? Both of us pay half the price of the ukulele we choose. So the ukulele will be ours, not just mine or yours. This will be really bad when we break up. I mean, I mean, we got a perfect relationship. We'll, ne we'll never break up. Just kidding. Our ukulele? That sounds great. Of course! This doesn't mean I'll play it, because I have no idea how to play one. <laughs> I'm more of a singer. Yeah, yeah, you know guys. I, I sing a little bit. <laughs> so you'll have to let me sing along to whatever you play. Oh, that's a terrible deal. No negotiation. That, that's right, girl. Sure, I'll just play a song you don't know. W what? Th then, then I'll just sing a random song along anyway. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> For some reason, I knew you'd say that. <laughs> anyway, oh ukulele. I like that. Thank you, Bryce. Well, our ukulele won't choose itself, will it? Let's go find one. Okay. <laughs> this is the most romantic thing I have ever seen. We spend our time looking for a ukulele that we both like. After looking through the store, we finally find a solid wood one. I think it's the size is a bit too small for him. But hey, as long as he's happy with it, right? 
<laughs> Whatever you say. After that, we go to the park and have some grilled chicken there. Tyracoon must really love them. He eats them really, really fast. That's probably because he's a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Oh, I didn't realize it's evening already. Oh, it is evening. Look at this guy. It's kind of cool looking. Neither did I. I guess it's time to go home. Huh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I'll walk you to the station. Thanks, Bryce. That's very nice of you. You're welcome. Well? Hmm? What's wrong? Uh, may, I, may I ask what you're going to do after this? Uh, oh, well, uh, uh, tons of homework, students, uh, well, n not, not much, really. Not, not much, really? Why? Well, I, I was wondering if you could stay a bit longer? I have something to talk to you about. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Of, of course, Tyracoon. Really? Th th thank you! So, what, what? Oh, sorry. So, what did you want to talk about? I'm sorry I talked in your voice for a minute. Well, uh, uh, it's about my fear of performing in front of many people. I, I've never told you this, but I was never like this. Up until junior high school, that is. I, I, I see. What happened? Well, when my body was too small, <laughs> it was easy for me to pick up a ukulele. During junior high school, I just, I started growing bigger and things weren't the same as they used to be. During a concert at a school event, there was an accident. Someone tripped and hit me and made me drop my ukulele. I tried to pick it up, but I couldn't. Now with my tiny arms like this, <laughs> I have a big head and a lot. I'm sorry, I'm breaking the moment. Tyracoon, I was struggling, trying to pick it up, but it only made things worse. The audience started laughing. Giggles grew into hysterical laughters. It was, it was horrible to say the least. My friend helped me pick the ukulele up, but it was far too late. I couldn't move a single muscle. I just stood there, frozen. Not this again, we're not talking about frozen. Ever since that day, every time I performed in front of many people, I couldn't help but ask myself these questions. Will I drop the instrument again? What would happen if I did? Will they laugh at me? Lots of dots. I'm... I'm so sorry. I should have told you this before I agreed to perform. No! No, you were really brave! You know? Knowing that you were scared but you still tackled the problem head on? I admire you for that. Thank you. Thank you, Bryce. It's, it's really weird because when I perform in front of you, none of those thoughts ever cross my mind. Somehow, you're special. <laughs> Maybe it's because there was no human at your concert. That's why me as an audience didn't remind you of anything from that event. Maybe. Oh, goodness. But whatever it is, I'm thankful for it. I'm glad that it's you. No, no. Tyracoon's making me blush. Don't, don't do that, Tyracoon. Thank you for sharing this with me, Tyracoon. And thank you for listening. And for giving me courage. You know, I just got an idea. If you're worried about picking up your ukulele, I'll do it. Huh? I'll, I'll do it. When, it. when you perform, I'll be there. And if you drop the ukulele, I'll dive in and grab it. And throw it right back up at you. That's crazy. Well, maybe the throwing part is. The point is... You don't have to worry. I'll help. You can count on me, Tyracoon. Bryce, thank you. That means a lot to me. Just be careful and don't step on me when I'm picking up your ukulele, okay? Well, oh, of course. I wouldn't, I wouldn't step on you. You know I wouldn't. <laughs> I was just messing with you. You know what? We haven't actually tried that new ukulele of ours. How about a song before we go home? Uh, here? Uh, in the park? Well... There's nobody around but us. Even if there is, I'll show you just how fast I can pick up your ukulele. So, are you in? W well, okay. That's the spirit. Oh my gosh, this is so romantic. So romantic. Oh, Tyracoon was reluctant at first, but after that, his tune was getting better and better. We said we were doing one song, but we ended up doing many more. This is the most romantic thing ever. It was so much fun, I didn't even really count. I'm glad he shared his story with me today, and I'm glad I could help him. This time, I'm sure he'll be fine. 
and the music club performance for this cultural event will be just fine. But I'll just forget about that for now. Right now, I just want to enjoy this moment with Tyra Coon. The end. <laughs> this was the most beautiful, most beautiful game I have ever, <laughs> ever played in my entire life. I, I loved it. <laughs> Alright guys, well that has been Jurassic Heart. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the game. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video. It really does help me out a lot. And subscribe so you can see my new videos as soon as they come out. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're watching this on Valentine's Day, happy Valentine's Day. And I'll see you guys in the next video.